So first I would like to ask for your permission for this video for educational purpose and for uh, publishing it on internet. Of course, not a problem. Thank you. Now tell me about your symptoms before the surgery a little. Uh, before I had the surgery, I had sciatic nerve pain going through either or leg and that spanned over a period of at least five to six years. Uh, and it was partially due to a dirt bike accident, um, but I had also had back pain before that. Okay. Um, and in the meantime, I had other accidents, but it was always stemming from that. So, but really bad pain up to, what would you say, give well, it the number. Coming and going between uh, 8 and 10. 8 and 10? And that for 5 years? For 5 years How did you manage it? Uh, pretty much every 6 to 9 months it would put me in the hospital uh, with sciatic nerve pain. I'd have to, they tried doing physical therapy. Um, I did that for a while. I'd go to the chiropractor, you know, here and there. Um, to try and correct, you know, what they thought was, you know, just out of alignment or out of adjustment. Mm -hmm. And it wasn't. It was nerve pain. It was disc pain. And finding this new procedure, I wasn't scared of actually having a back surgery anymore. Because um, everybody I've ever talked to said, stay away from surgery. Surgery is the worst thing I've ever done. And that's kind of what I dealt with. And I just thought I was going to have to live with it. Yeah, you t tried to toughen it up, and yes. but then they, they said, uh, you said just a uh, few hours after surgery you were walking. Tell me about your initial stay in the hospital. The initial stay in the hospital um, was great. I was in, in and out, uh, had the surgery, woke up from uh, the anesthesia, and within an hour I was walking to the bathroom and walking up and down the hall with the nurse. How long did you stay in the hospital? I stayed overnight. Uh, no, the, the surgery just was about three weeks ago, correct? Yes, three weeks. How far have you come this far? You told me that you had some nerve irritation on the side of the leg after the surgery. That uh, 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 Kind of a sharp shooting, tingly pain, mm -hmm. throbbing. Um, but that lasted maybe a day or so to where okay. it was really bad. And then it slowly started getting better day by day. Okay. And rapidly. So and you, you described to me that you have that like a shooting pain that is now becoming random yep. and it's going on the downside, it's going better? Yeah, it's, it's, the, it's random and it's, now it's getting few and far between mm -hmm. and the, the pain level uh, when it you know, happens is mm -hmm. a lot less. Uh, usually just a little bit of icing numbs it enough to where I, it goes away or I walk around a little bit. Sure. And it, it seems to work itself Excellent. out. Excellent. So. Now I'm good, just going to swing to the, the monitor and show yeah. the, what we did. Now, you had the L5S1, um, what we call Olaf. And here are the, first of all, the screws and the cage. They're in perfect position. And you had the L5S1 degenerative disc disease and the um, disc herniation that caused you a problem. And as you said, you were for many years in and out of the hospital and many people say you cannot fix that because yeah. fixing of that is too much damage and is like the, it doesn't work. But then we spent over tens of years some, for some people, mm -hmm. putting them in the hospital, spent significant amount of resources, whereas we can fix it now with that minimal invasive technique. But as well, mm -hmm. I think it's important to know that, um, that the bone itself as well needs about the uh, uh, what we say about six months to a year to grow back together mm -hmm. what we are just finding out that with our minimal invasive technique because we are not stripping the muscle off the bone mm -hmm. the bone get more blood supply actually they heal faster much faster than um uh, open surgery but yeah. still a time frame that is not within weeks it's within months so you still have to be careful right, right. yes <laughs> and be as careful. Matter, yes yes as a matter of fact we just find out that is one of the downside of all. If people feel so good so fast that they start doing things that you know you wouldn't imagine. Yeah, my boss already told me I need to come back to work because <laughs> I'm moving around too good. <laughs> okay. Well, no, we want you to be careful. Right. Take care of yourself and slowly at your. Um, overall, so far, happy with the result so far. Very happy. Excellent. Very happy. The the initial pain that I was feeling, that's completely gone now. Excellent. Just the the soreness. And the tingling, you know, I can live with that. That's Excellent. nothing compared to what I felt before. Excellent. Thank you very much for the interview.